Welcome to Oleoboard's Advanced Background Removal Tool Tutorial. A mouthful? Yes it is. But this tool is actually an extremely useful tool to help you create really clean mood board designs when you're looking to incorporate items that have a background attached to them. So let's say that you would like to use this hook in your mood board design, but you've got this gray background that you absolutely don't want incorporated into your mood board. So to get rid of this gray background, what we're going to do is we're going to use the background removal tool option. What you want to do is click in this little checkbox that has the word remove next to it. So we're going to click that box and you're going to notice that it actually pulled out a little bit of the gray background, but it didn't pull out the entire thing. So we're going to have to jump into the advanced options and see if we can clean this up a little bit more. So we're going to go back up to the toolbar and we're going to click on the advanced options. Now in the advanced options, you get two versions of this hook. So the top image is actually the original image, and the bottom image is the image that you're trying to manipulate. When you're manipulating your image, you're going to notice that there's three options here. You get a checkered option, a gray option, and a white option. You can choose whichever option it is that makes it easiest for you to see the background that you're trying to remove. I find it's easiest on the gray. So we've got part of this background removed, but we want to clean it up a little bit more. So let's go up to our toolbar, and we're going to choose the sample color option. Now if I want to remove this gray background in this image, I have to click on a part of that gray background in the top image. So I'm going to click here, and you'll notice that by clicking in the top image, I've now removed basically the entire gray background that was interfering with this product that I want to use. Now, if I play around a little bit with the toggles up here, Adjust Darkest Color Removed, I can actually add a little bit more light and bring the background back in, or I can pull it out a little bit, even to the point of losing the hook altogether. What we're looking for is a happy medium where I can get a really clean image without bringing back too much of that gray background. So that's looking pretty clean to me. We've got a little bit of shadow here to show where the, the hook base is, but that's fine. So I'm going to go ahead and say apply changes to this because I'm pretty happy with this design. And now we've applied the changes and now you no longer have that rectangular uh, gray background that was kind of interfering with using this product to begin with. Now you can stick this hook on any colored wall you wish.